Um, next, we have a scene from Ascension Day. Um, so please welcome Ansley Ball and Sarah Mayfiag. I'm so sorry if I broke your last name. <laughs> about your complexion problems. And judging by his skin, we're waiting for the miracle. Do you think so? I thought he was just adorable. Hey, Charity, this is a broad category. It's strange, but as cute as a bug. What was his name? Randy? Who was the, those loons again? <laughs> I'm glad you're our junior counselor. So am I. Just, well, I'm sorry, Faith, but please just try to understand that in some ways it's not easy having a person in charge of your whole cabin be your sister. You're afraid I'll embarrass you. You know what I mean. Oh, I do. I'll cut back on the chewing tobacco and I'll only spit on the floor after the lights are out. You get it from Mother. You're so sarcastic, both of you. You could just be a little more, I don't know, easygoing. What does that mean? Like, if a boy smiles at you, you don't have to turn to stone or anything. What on earth? You just don't act like the other girls, and that makes them, I don't know. I certainly hope I'm not like the other girls. Uncomfortable. For one thing, I'm older than the other girls. Only a year and a half. I am not a giggling 16-year-old. That's just the sort of thing I mean. We're not supposed to giggle or laugh. We're not supposed to goof around or have a good time. Charity, of course I want you to have a good time. I don't know what you're talking about. I want you to have a good time. This is a very special place. This camp meant so much to me last year. I just want it to be the same for you, I really do. Listen, it's simple, I'll just ask Pastor Telepison to assign me to your cabin. It doesn't matter to me. No, Faith, I'm sorry. Really, it doesn't. No, really. June can take the night on the cabin, I'll take the roof cabin. It's no trouble at all. I think I'd be better with the young no, people. Please. Anyways. Not just saying this. I wish I hadn't said a thing. I really do. I met somebody here last year, didn't she? That's what made it so special. I met lots of people. A boy, I mean. And I accepted our Lord as my personal savior. Is he here again this year? Wesley? You wrote his name on the inside back cover of one of your notebooks. <coughs> about a dozen times. Here they go again. They're going crazy out there. So mournful. So lonely and despairing. Can you imagine? being that horny. Honest to goodness, Charity, why do you insist on reducing everything to, to what? To the lowest common denominator. That's what. You can't even say it. You can't even say the word. Anyway, you don't know a thing about blooms. And nothing is beautiful to you unless it's lonely and awful and sad and touching. They have half a dozen different cries and each one has a different purpose. I'm just so frightened you'll turn into a spinster. There's one for alarm, there's a feeding call, and yes, of course, mating. My sister, spinster Sunday school teacher. There's one particular cry for when they're lost. When they've become separated and can't find each other. A terrible cry. It's so terribly desperate. 